Arriving in Rwanda during September last year, the refugees and asylum seekers suffered in Libya. They had gone there from different African countries with the goal of crossing over the Mediterranean and into Europe. The refugees have dreams of reaching Europe and Rwanda agreed to host them through their transition. In different ways and at different times, some refugees have been able to find host countries in Europe. As they were not abandoned when they were persecuted in Libya, Rwanda once again showed the refugees that they were valuable. They were included in the primary group to be vaccinated against COVID-19. In the early hours of Wednesday morning, 351 workers, refugees and asylum seekers at the Gashora camp began receiving the COVID-19 vaccine. After receiving the vaccine, a member at the camp spoke to Television Rwanda. He was happy to be considered among the primary group to receive the vaccine. I feel very happy, very happy. So from the first point, I was very afraid. I was very, very afraid of taking this vaccination uh, because I fear of vaccination in general. But now I feel very, very, very happy. Very happy that I already took this vaccination. I feel like uh, coronavirus will not come to me again at all. Yes. As a refugee here in Uganda, yes. uh, do you expect to get it in a very soon, like it is the vaccination, like a very soon? Like oh, how, how do you think this? Uh, no, I wasn't thinking that uh, I'll, let, I'll get this vaccination very soon like this. I was thinking maybe I will not, I'll never be vaccinated here at all. Uh, it's because I know vaccination is not easy. Uh, it's not easy to get and it's not easy for a refugee like me to be vaccinated. I wasn't expecting it at all. But I'm very happy that uh, today you, ha you have vaccinated, they have vaccinated us. Dina Atala, one of the day staff at the camp, says she's happy to be considered for the vaccine as their workplace puts them at high risk of contracting COVID-19. Of course, it is very important, especially in this ETM, because here we receive Libyan evacuees and it's very important for uh, POCs here or people of concern to get it so that they can actually travel to a third country. Uh, also for us because we're working here in the front lines, so of course it's very important for us as well to get the vaccination. There are so many rumors worldwide about the vaccines and the side effects and all of that, but um, I would just say think about it that way, like we do have a pandemic and COVID really, really, really kills people out there. So I don't know, like, would you rather have the pandemic or get affected by the virus or would you just get a vaccine? So think about it that way. A vaccine would definitely be much better than the pandemic. It, it really, really saves your lives, you know. Kayumba Olivier, the permanent secretary of the ministry in charge of emergency management, says the vaccination program in refugee camps will continue with special focus in other camps. Vaccination is going uh, on uh, through the general program we have in Rwanda to vaccinate to vaccinate all uh, residents in Rwanda, being nationals or non-nationals, and uh, refugees here, particularly, they are going to be resettled as per the memorandum of understanding we have with the the African Union and the UNHCR. So they, since they are going to be resettled, they are also part of the vaccination program. 351 people at the Gashara camp were vaccinated, 197 of them refugees. Refugees below the age of 18 were not vaccinated because they are considered minors. Umgari Jade, RTV News.